teachers and maids. Since we all, this is Tawish, since we all know this is the inaugural ceremony of prestigious society soapbox, I, as a poet, chose to wrote and write a poem which is purely dedicated to present or introduce the theme of it. Long, long ago, there lived a witch by the silent sea. Voices were oppressed, and no one heard any hearts bleed. Fear had blanketed all the lives. The witch had cast her spell at a thousand miles. The town was abandoned with no map record and no files. No one dared to raise their head nor any hat. If someone did, they were buried alive beneath the sand. Then one day, a boy sailed across, while people were frozen in the brutal frost. He marched towards the haunted castle and screamed, I don't fear you. I may speak until my throat flutters. I'm not among those pity humans who stutter. The witch was triggered. She quickly hung the spell over wicked empty skulls. She prepared a poison and hummed a green potion. The boy vehemently dropped his box over the marble and he pulled his mic out of the pocket and called up to all of the people. He stood tall over it to design her wickedness to crumble. Fortunately, unfortunately, the witch was sensitive to sound. Her ears started melting towards the ground. <coughs> Soon gathered the people in a huge crowd. Children started giggling and adults screamed aloud. The witch dissolved and vanished in the frequency of sound. The boy was crowned as the king for his courageous voice. And the wooden box was called Soapbox, the box of justice, hereafter bedecked as the throne. Soon the people grew bold and vigilant. Everyone had their say. No one was found silent ever again. It is said as the legend goes by, long, long ago, a witch was burned alive by the silent sea. Thank you so much. Enjoy your evening.